my channel. My name is Sandy, and in today's video, we are doing one of my favorite things. We are going to go to Home Goods, and we are going to be on the hunt for some designer dupes. And Home Goods is the best place to do that. You get that high end look for less. So let's get right into it because I know it's going to be a good day shopping. walk into my home goods they had all sorts of summer outdoor decor and pottery this little planter caught my eye because I love that rattan detailing on it and it was only $12.99 that'd be really pretty inside like on your kitchen counter this terracotta pot I love those little handles do not move they're glued on there and that was $29.99 I'd probably use that inside and put like a fig tree or something like that in there I thought that was gorgeous and then this white one you all was mammoth. I could not believe I could not even lift that up. Again, I might use that indoors, but obviously indoors or outdoors. Now, these little jugs over here um, that sort of look vintage looking, I love that cream one that was $69.99. And then that greenish one that looked like there was like brown dirt rubbed on it, that one was $29.99. I loved both of those. Now, moving over here, the scalloped edge trays are real popular right now. This was $14.99. With that floral bottom, obviously, it's probably meant for more outdoors. But what to say that you can't put something down on there and use it, you know, just like the other scallop trays. I always like a good marble tray, and I love the gold handles on it. It was very heavy. This is gorgeous for your bathroom, even in your kitchen. Put your soap pumps on there. Just loved that. Now, if you are like me, I love to organize, and this is a great place to find organization. They have all these acrylic organizers for your pantry, your fridge, um, just so many good pieces. This I thought was really interesting. It was actually two like little milk cartons, so I guess you could pour your milk in there or your orange juice. But again, this is just a great place to find some good organizers at a great price. And I'm not sure if you're familiar with the container store, but it's a high-end organization store and their prices are high-end. I even like this little wood tray for your utensils, and I'm actually in the market. I need to go back and look for one. I need to measure my drawer first, but they have all that type of stuff as well. So a good resource when you're ready to organize. Now I moved over where the cutting boards are, and this uh, little wood riser I thought would be so great for the middle of your kitchen table with a pretty like planter on it. And then this rectangular little tray caught my eye. I love the detail on the end. And again, I thought that would be pretty in the middle of like your island with some fruit on it. I just loved that. Maybe I was blind on you forever while I tried to
Home Goods always has good lamps, and I moved over to this and because these couple lamps caught my eye. This tall, sort of antiquing looking one would just be gorgeous. It's really tall and would be gorgeous like in an entryway and they had two, so you could put them on each side of you know, your table or buffet. And then that little wicker one I fell in love with. It reminds me of a Serena and Lily one that is $129. It's a good dupe, the ones that are here at Home Goods. The only difference is there is a brass bottom on the one from Serena and Lily, and this one has the wicker bottom. But I just thought it was a great little dupe. This little pink lamp I thought was so cute and would be cute for like a laundry room or even a little girl's room. Just adorable, and it was really reasonably priced, and I really like the shade on that. And you could even take that shade off and put like a little um, scallop shade for like a little girl's room. These blue glazed ones were another good option and a very reasonable. Now, I found this lamp, and there were two of them, as you can see, that were a little shorter than those other ones that I saw and I just showed you. And you got to sort of look around because, as you can see, this is sort of like in the middle of the aisle where they put furniture. So it wasn't in like the aisle with all the regular lamps, but this was another good option if you needed something a little shorter. like really unique pieces. This little lady, obviously she looks like she's just sketched with that round black frame. It looks so vintage to me and would be a, so pretty in a bathroom or like a powder bathroom. Now moving over to the mirrors. This mirror is a good dupe for the mirror from Anthropology. This is on sale at Anthropology for $638, and that one was only $129. So those were a big fad. I think these arch gold ones are now sort of on trend, and they had, as you can see, several different sizes of those. And I actually really like those because I think they're a little bit more timeless than the one from Anthropology. So that's a good option. And they're really reasonably priced. Now, this little chest is probably not for everybody. It looks very, I think, more like Victorian, but it just caught my eye, and I liked the little floral pattern inside. So if you like that sort of, you know, Victorian, almost vintage look. Now, these two stools here, um, I just had to stop and look at them because they're very similar with that nail heads around the bottom to ones that I have that I've had for a long time that I bought at Wayfair. And obviously these are a lot better priced. Mine have like a little bit more of an arched back to them, but I thought this was a really good option. Then moving over in this area, I really liked the texture and detail of this vase. You don't even need to put any florals in there. It was really nice. I thought these candlestick holders were really unique. Again, just has that really organic feel to them, and they, again, were really reasonably priced. Now, I moved over to the middle section, and they had a bunch of dough bowls, and Pottery Barn always has dough bowls, Wayfair has them, and, of course, these were for a fraction of the cost, and I love decorating with dough bowls. I just think it's just a fun way to put fruit, moss balls, what have you. This marble just, oh gosh, I could not tell you how much I fell in love with it. It was so heavy and had that scalloped, um, like look to the end of it. It was beautiful. <laughs>
Now, sometimes you can find a needle in a haystack at Home Goods, and this was one. These wood balls sell for over $100 at Pottery Barn, and those three were identical, and they were $19.99. Just unbelievable. I love a good black pot. I don't need any more. I actually need more cream, but they had a few really pretty ones, and this is a good place to find um, any type of pottery. I really like that. And this cream one just reminded me of a jug where you'd pour water out or, or something. And I love the detail on that one. That was a good option too. Now these glazed pots, I absolutely love. These were a little bit bigger than I've seen before. They had like real wide mouths to them or rest, I would have grabbed one of them. So they have that glazing and like that terracotta at the bottom. And I wish they had a thinner one and I just was a little bummed that they didn't have one. Now, these garland beads are sort of on trend again, and over at Pottery Barn, they have them for $129, and these here at Home Goods were $29.99, and I even like that little uh, wood chain that was sort of cute. Um, I guess it's like chain links. Now, you all, this is the star of the show. This fig tree was over seven foot tall, and I love the pot that they had in it. And oh my gosh, it was so real like looking. It was $199.99, which considering how tall it was and so real life looking, I thought it wasn't a bad price. If you have high ceilings in your home, this would be gorgeous. And if you don't have a green thumb like me, are going to wrap up our shopping today with one final look at another item this three-piece little outdoor set it's a nautica set and it's $3.99 i love that this top of this little table lifts up and you can use it for storage and for $3.99 i thought that was a really good price it looked beautiful out on your deck even a sunroom i just absolutely loved that well, like I said, that's going to wrap it up for us today. Thank you for coming along with me shopping. If you could give me a thumbs up. Also, if you could just drop an emoji or say hello in the comments, I'd appreciate it. I've been talking to some other YouTubers and we're all noticing that we really need to start telling our followers this because it, for whatever reason, the algorithm has changed and our videos aren't being pushed out. So I appreciate it. And if you're new here, I hope you will consider subscribing. I can't wait to my next video. I have a master bedroom makeover that I'm excited to share with you. So make sure you turn that bell notification on so you know when I upload next. And also I started a brand new Instagram account. So I'm going to put it up here. If you'd like to go follow me over there for more day to day, I'd appreciate it. Bye.